Step 3. Editing the model in the interior elevation window. Select the interior elevation that shows the kitchen cabinets next to the rock. Right click and select Open Interior Elevation from the context menu. The interior elevation opens. Bring up the SEO palette from the design menu. Select the two leftmost cabinet bases and the two wall cabinets above them. The bodies of these elements intersect with the rock. With these four elements selected, click the Get Target Elements button in the SEO palette. Select the rock to the left of these elements and click the Get Operator Elements button. Make sure the Subtraction option is selected in the Choose an Operation field and click the Execute button to subtract the body of the rock from the cabinets. Now select all the cabinet base elements except for the leftmost one in the range, and all wall cabinets except for the leftmost one in the hood in the vent. To change the appearance of these cabinets, open their settings dialog from the info box. Open up the kitchen cabinet settings panel of the settings dialog and click the door tab page. In the graphics list of available door styles on the left, select style 5 by clicking on it in the list. Click OK to leave the dialog. The door style of all selected cabinets is now changed in the model. You can fine-tune the appearance of the cabinets with further settings of the doors, knobs, etc. as you wish. Open Section 3 by double-clicking it in the project map. Here you can again see that when you change something in an interior elevation window, all changes will be propagated throughout the whole model and will display correctly in any other model viewpoint.